If we take a look at tan x, the graph y equals tan x, if we did a table of values, we're going to see that this graph looks quite a bit different than sine and cosine. This graph has asymptotes. And here's where two of those asymptotes occur. But the, the graph does go through the point zero, zero. And it looks like so. And then it continues this pattern over and over and over again. So one of the properties of this is it has intercepts every pi. So every pi we've got one of these um, curves going crossing the x-axis. Okay, so this is a graph that you need to make sure that you have down in your journal. And what we'll do now is talk about its properties, and I'll work through this one with you. So we'll talk about its domain. The domain is not all real numbers, because we have places where there are asymptotes. And so the easiest way to describe the domain of tan function is to say that x is everything, x is all real numbers, except x is not, x is not pi over 2, it's not this, plus any multiples of pi. You see, the distance between each um, each point on the curve is pi units. So same thing, the distance between the asymptotes must be pi. So pi over 2 plus any multiple of pi takes us to asymptotes where x cannot be. So the domain of tan is all real numbers except pi over 2 plus n pi. The range, though, is from negative infinity to positive infinity. So all y values, y is all real numbers. What's the x-intercept? Well, we've already talked about that. 0, pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi. So the x-intercept we could say is 0, this one, plus any multiples of pi. Technically, we don't even need to write the 0, because 0 plus this will just be that. So we can just simplify that and say it's any multiple of pi. It's 0 pi, 1 pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi, minus 1 pi, minus 2 pi. The x-intercept is n pi. The y-intercept is what? 0. y-intercept is 0. There's only one of those. What's the maximum value of this function? Well, it goes on to infinity, so there is no max. And what's the minimum value of this function? Same thing. It goes down forever. There is no minimum. So those would be the properties of y equals tan x.